to Inside There. Today I'm going to be doing a balloon blanket. You need the straw, tape, string, and balloons. Which balloon do you think will travel the farthest distance? Blue. Why? Because it's bigger. Okay. Which balloon do you think will travel the shortest distance? Me, because it's small. One. Nine, I think it's a good thing to go. It did like that. Go! Oh, it's it. Oh! This experiment shows Newton's law of motion. everyone my, my name is Gwaylin and I did um, a, di a diorama for my project and like human babies um, baby gorillas are called infants and in the dad is called a silverback and there's and there's a bunch of moms and the mom's job is it is to um, protect the infants. And the dad's job is, is in the silverback's job is, is is to protect the moms and the infants. So how so um so um the little gorillas they sleep up. In the they try to build their nests in the trees, and the bigger ones, D try to build their nests on the uh, on the ground because the bigger ones are too heavy to sleep up in the trees. And and I actually think that the baby gorillas kind of need to sleep under the trees so that if a predator come, c comes, you can't get up to the infants. And the silverback can fight back. And that's how gorillas act. Hello, my name is John. I am seven years old and our science project is rocks. So we I'm going to explain my, my chart and I'm going to tell you my fir the first mystery rock. This one. This here you can see it up close. It's kinda of shiny. And that's good because one of our questions is actually, is it shiny? So Mystery walk, rock number one. Also, by the way, we have an app that helps us. So, number one, app guess, side chest. Can we scratch it? Yes, easily. Is it green? Is, is the green coarse or fine? Coarse. And shiny or dull? Shiny. Our guess, it's the same as the app. What number did the app say again? It said, it said, chest. 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 Uh, no, no, no. Number two? No. no this is Number two. App guess. Gran gr granite. Can we scratch it? Yes. Barely. Is the green coarse or fine? 
course, um, shiny or dull. Dull. Number three. App guess limestone. Can we scratch it? Yes, easily. Is the is the grain coarse or fine? Fine. Shiny or dull? Dull. Our guess same. Oh, and also for, for the last one, our guess is same. Um, num number four. This is actually two rocks in one. This. Yeah, this here. Get closer. This. That here. That here. Here you go. Oh, did you show this one? Yeah, I did. So now it's time. Oh, we I gotta explain the two in one, right? So the two in one is the so the app so the guess is that they think that this is cor corzio and this one and the gold part is pyrite. So can we, um now can we scratch it? No. Is the green is the green coarse or fine? Coarse, shiny or dull? Shiny plus dull. Our guess same. So it's kind of got shiny. Hold it up while you're talking. Oh no. The app is app drops the fairy the tile, I think. I can't pronounce it. Um can we scratch it? Yep, easily. Is the green coarse or fine? Coarse? Shiny or dull? Dull plus shiny. Number six. Do we agree with the app? Uh, no, yes, I we do agree with the app. Rock collection on that plate. Cool. Alright, well, thanks everybody. And Today we're going to be making rock candy. You need a pot, sugar, skewers, water, and some jars, and some closing Um, The question is that how does sugar crystals form? And that's what we're going to be learning today, making rock candy. Crystallization. So when you you can put a lot of sugar in hot water, and when you leave hot water out for a while, all it get the water gets cold and the sugar wants to get away from the cold water. So this when they see the sugary um, stick, all the sugar goes to the stick and climbs and keeps on going until they form crystals. This and then you then you see all these crystals around the rock candy.